When we think about financial success, it's easy to get caught up in those big exciting goals, like buying your dream home, retiring early, or becoming a millionaire. Those are fantastic aspirations. But personal finance isn't just about those big moments. It's about everyday choices, small wins, and consistent progress. Think of it like climbing a mountain. Reaching the summit is the ultimate goal, but along the way, there are base camps and breathtaking views that are just as important. These smaller milestones keep you motivated and prove you're capable of achieving great things. They're the stepping stones to financial freedom. In this video, we'll celebrate those often overlooked financial milestones that speak volumes about your financial health. Whether you're just starting or well on your way to financial independence, this video will help you recognize and celebrate your progress. Let's get started. Let's talk about a crucial financial milestone living below your means. This is a concept that can transform your financial life. Now you might be thinking, Chris, that doesn't sound exciting. It might even seem a bit boring or restrictive at first glance. But trust me, mastering this skill is the foundation for building lasting wealth. It's the bedrock upon which financial stability is built. It's not about deprivation. It's about making intentional choices with your money. It's about being mindful and strategic with your spending. When you consistently spend less than you earn, you create a powerful gap between your income and expenses. This gap is your financial breathing room. And that gap, that's where the magic happens. It's where opportunities for growth and security are born. That's where you find money to invest, pay off debt faster, and build a secure future. It's the key to unlocking financial freedom. Living below your means is about being in control of your money, not letting it control you. It's about empowerment and making your money work for you. It's about making conscious decisions and prioritizing what truly matters. It's about aligning your spending with your values and goals. It might mean saying no to impulse purchases or finding creative ways to save on everyday expenses. These small changes add up over time. And the best part, it gets easier over time. As you build these habits, they become second nature. As you experience the benefits, less financial stress, more security, and the ability to pursue your goals, it becomes a lifestyle, a rewarding and fulfilling lifestyle. So if you're already living below your means, give yourself a pat on the back. You're doing something truly remarkable. You're miles ahead of the game. You're setting yourself up for long-term success. And if you're still working on it, don't get discouraged. Every effort you make brings you closer to your financial goals. Every step toward financial freedom is worth celebrating. Each milestone is a victory on your journey to financial independence. Here's a milestone that deserves a standing ovation, avoiding lifestyle inflation. It's a significant achievement that often goes unnoticed. This one's huge because it's a silent wealth killer creeping up on you without warning. As you earn more, it can be tempting to upgrade your lifestyle. Bigger house, fancier car, more extravagant vacations, the allure of luxury can be hard to resist, but lifestyle inflation can sabotage your financial goals without you realizing it. It's like a hidden trap that derails your progress. Imagine you get a raise. It feels like a reward for your hard work. Fantastic. But then, you start spending more on things you didn't need before. Suddenly, your expenses balloon. Suddenly that raise has disappeared into thin air, absorbed by your inflated lifestyle. It's a vicious cycle. Conquering lifestyle inflation is about breaking that cycle. It's about taking control of your financial destiny. It's about making a conscious choice to live below your means, even as your income grows. This requires discipline and foresight. It's about being intentional with your spending and focusing on long-term financial security over short-term gratification. Planning and prioritizing are key. This doesn't mean you can't enjoy the fruits of your labor. Treat yourself, but do so wisely. It's about finding a balance a balance that ensures your future is secure while enjoying the present. When you resist lifestyle inflation, you free up more money to invest, save, and build a solid financial foundation. Your future self will thank you. You're no longer trapped in the rat race of keeping up with the Joneses. You're free from unnecessary stress. You're free to define success on your own terms and build a life of true wealth and abundance. Your journey is unique. If you've dodged the lifestyle inflation trap, give yourself a high five. Celebrate your financial wisdom. You're on the right track. Keep moving forward with confidence and clarity. Let's talk about a financial milestone that deserves a victory dance. Maxing out your retirement accounts. If you've hit that contribution limit, you are a rock star. This is a big deal because it takes incredible foresight and discipline to prioritize your future self. Most people focus on immediate needs and desires. 
but those who think long-term and prioritize their future selves ultimately win with money. When you max out your retirement accounts, you're telling your future self, I've got your back. You're investing in your financial freedom, your ability to retire comfortably, and your peace of mind later in life. It's like planting a tree. The best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago, but the second best time is today. The sooner you start investing in your retirement, the more time your money has to grow and compound. That compound growth is where the real magic happens. Start small, be consistent, and gradually increase your contributions over time. Every little bit counts. Let's talk about a financial milestone that's a true testament to your long-term thinking. The moment your investments surpass the value of all your depreciating items combined. This is huge. Depreciating items are things like cars, electronics, furniture, things that lose value over time. When the majority of your net worth is tied up in stuff that's constantly losing value, it can be a slippery slope. On the other hand, investments have the potential to grow over time. When the value of your investments outpaces your depreciating items, it's a clear sign you're shifting your mindset from consumer to investor. You're prioritizing building wealth and creating a more secure financial future. This milestone is about playing the long game. True wealth isn't about accumulating stuff, it's about making smart financial decisions that set you up for long-term success. If you've reached this milestone, give yourself a round of applause. You're thinking like a true investor. That's a recipe for long-term financial success. $10,000 net worth, you've built a strong foundation. Congratulations. Reaching a $10,000 net worth is a significant accomplishment. It represents a mindset shift, a commitment to taking control of your finances. Think of it like building a house. You wouldn't expect to erect walls without first laying a solid foundation, right? The same principle applies to your financial well-being. This milestone is about more than just the number. It's about the habits and disciplines you've developed. It's about consistently living below your means, saving diligently, and making intentional choices with your money. These habits are the building blocks of lasting financial security. Reaching a $10,000 net worth is a testament to your commitment to your financial well-being. From here, you can leverage this solid foundation to achieve even greater financial milestones. $100,000 net worth. You're officially in the big leagues. Wow, $100,000 net worth. This is a major financial milestone and you should be incredibly proud. It's a testament to your hard work and smart financial decisions. Reaching this level of wealth doesn't happen by accident. It requires a strategic approach and a clear understanding of your financial goals. It takes dedication, discipline, and a commitment to making smart financial choices consistently. Every decision, no matter how small, has contributed to this success. Think back to when you first started your financial journey. Remember the challenges you faced and the lessons you learned along the way. Remember those small wins, those moments when you resisted the urge to splurge and instead chose to invest in your future? Each of those moments was a step towards this achievement. Those choices have led you here. They were the building blocks of your financial success. They've compounded over time, building upon one another to create this incredible achievement. Your persistence and patience have paid off. A $100,000 net worth signifies that you're no longer just playing the financial game, you're winning it. You're setting yourself up for even greater success. You're building a future where money is no longer a source of stress, but a tool to create the life you've always dreamed of. Your financial freedom is within reach. This milestone shows that you're in control of your money and making decisions that will benefit you for years to come. Your financial acumen is evident. With a solid foundation of $100,000, the possibilities are endless. Your journey is just beginning, and the future looks incredibly bright. Investments earning more than your job. You've achieved financial freedom. Now, this is a game changer. When your investments start earning more than your job, that's true financial freedom. It's the ultimate dream, and you've made it a reality. Think about what this means. It means you're no longer trading your time for money. Your money is working for you, generating enough passive income to cover your living expenses, and then some. This is the point where work becomes optional. You have the freedom to pursue your passions, spend more time with loved ones, or simply enjoy the fruits of your labor without being tied to a paycheck. Reaching this milestone is a testament to the power of compound growth and the importance of long-term investing. It's proof that with patience, discipline, and a solid financial plan, anything is possible. Achieving this level of financial freedom might seem like a distant dream, but it's within your reach. Start small, be consistent, and never underestimate the power of compound growth.
Celebrate your wins, keep climbing. As we've explored these milestones, I hope you've taken a moment to celebrate just how far you've come on your financial journey. Remember, financial independence isn't about reaching one massive goal. It's about those smaller, meaningful victories earned along the way. Each step from building your first $10,000 to watching your investments outpace your income is a testament to your hard work and dedication. Whether you're just starting out or you've already hit some major milestones, remember this, you are capable of achieving amazing things with your finances. Keep learning, keep growing, and never stop striving for financial freedom. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tips on achieving financial success. Until next time, keep crushing those financial goals.